the electric field of an electromagnetic wave in the free space is given by e equal to e naught cos omega t minus k z i k. From this equation, I hope it is visible to all of you. Electric field is along the i k, and the wave is propagating. That is a v or c. Omega t minus k z. It means it is z axis, so it is k k. The corresponding magnetic induction vector. Firstly, we will see the direction of the magnetic induction vector. We know c equal to e cross b. C is given by k k. So I cross X. Now we will make the circle I J and K. So I cross J will be K. So K K is known as I cross J. It means one thing is clear: magnetic field will be along the J axis. But here also J, here also J, here also J, here also J. It means all the four options are appears to be correct. Now we will see the value of the magnetic field. Now what is the value of the B naught? We all know out of the B naught in E naught, E naught is very high compared to B naught. And we we say E naught is given by B naught into C. So B naught is given by E naught by C. So we see here B equal to B naught, then cos omega t minus k z. And direction of the B we are getting that is j k. So cos omega t minus k z j k. Cos omega t minus k z j k. This is wrong. This is wrong. No, it is B equal to B naught. Or B naught is E naught by C. So E naught by C only option two is a true. So right answer to this problem is option two.